Hi guys, you're welcome back to this step-by-step -step guide on how you can buy PyCoin or PyToken on Git.io. PyCoin is a new cryptocurrency that has gained popularity due to its unique features and potential for growth. Git.io is a reputable cryptocurrency exchange that lists PyToken for trading. In this guide, we will walk through the step-by-step -step process of buying PyToken on Git.io. It's very easy, just make sure you follow me to the end of this video to get it all. And also, if this video is helpful to you, do it to like, subscribe and leave a comment. So let's get started the first step you have to take now is to open your gate.io app and in case you've not created a gate.io account here's an opportunity for you to do that just go back to the description of this video you will see the registration link right there tap on it they'll be able to create a gate.io account and also if you don't know how to create a gate.io account there's a video link right there tap on the link they'll be able to watch how to create a gate.io account is that easy so guys once you've created a gate.io account then the next step you have to take now is to tap on where you can see trade you can see where it's written trade so let me tap on it right away so guys can see here's the next step this way you're going to be able to buy your pi token you can see where it is written spot right there spot is selected so this is the spot trading on gate.io so guys now the next step you have to take now is to tap on where you can see btc slash usdt you have to change that pair right there that cryptocurrency pair you have to change it to pi slash usdt so guys what you have to do now is to tap on it so let me tap on it so guys can see here there are numerous pair of cryptocurrency right here you can see the first one ethereum slash usdt the second one there is btc slash usdt the third one there is gt slash usdt Why the fourth one there is pi slash usdt you can see it right there it is a new cryptocurrency pair you can see it right there so what you have to do now is to tap on it to select it but in case you can't find it right here what you can simply do is to use the search icon at the top so let me tap on the search icon real quick then what you are going to do next now is to type in pi so let me type in pi pi then you tap on search so guys now you can see it's right there you can see the search result right there pi is at the top of the search result pi slash usdt so what you can do now is to tap on it to select it so let me tap on it real quick so as now you can see the cryptocurrency pay has changed now to pi slash usdt you can see it right there at the top what used to be there was btc slash usdt so guys now the next step you have to take now is to make sure buy is selected you can see that buy is selected right there make sure you tap on buy then the next step you have to take now is to tap on where you can see limit so let me tap on limit so what you have to do now is to tap on where you can see smart market which is the second option so let me tap on smart market so as now you can see we have selected smart market the reason why we actually selected smart market is because we want to sell at the current market price so as now the next step you have to take now is to impute the amount of pi token that you actually want to buy um but first of all let me get to show you guys this guys you can see my available balance my available balance there is 2.33 usdt you can see try right there that's the amount of usdt that i have in my account and that's what you're going to be using to buy the pi token in your gate.io account so what you have to do now is actually to impute the amount of of usdt that you want to use to buy this pi token so for you to do that you have to tap on where you can see total in bracket usdt so let me tap on it so you can decide to use um one usdt to buy the pi token or you can decide to use something depending on your balance you can decide to use anything depending on your balance but i don't have up to that amount of usdt so let me just leave it at two usdt and also guys can use this slider right there to impute the amount of usdt that i want to use to buy the pi token let me use that slider so i can decide to use 25 percent of my um of my usdt i can decide to use 50 percent of my usdt i can decide to use 75 percent of my usdt i can decide to use 100 percent of the usdt that i have in my account so let me use um let me use the 100 percent of the usdt that i have in my account you can see right there the amount is appearing there 2.83 usdt that's the total amount of usdt that i have in my gate.io account so i want to use that to buy pi token so after i've repeated the amount of usdt that i want to use to buy the pi token the next step you have to take nice is tap on buy pi you can see you try the buy pi let me tap on it so guys here's the next step now what you have to do now is to tap on confirm this is the details of the transaction you want to carry out other price is smart market um the total amount of usdt you're going to be using is 2.33 usdt so let me tap on confirm right away 
so guys now you can see it's loading wow guys other play successfully you can see the other field right there at the top so guys what you have to do now is to go over to your assets so you can check the balance of your pie to see if the pie token is already reflecting in your gate.io account or if your balance of pie token has increased that's if you already have some pie token before you actually bought this one so let me tap on assets i didn't have any pie token before now so let me tap on assets then you make sure you tap on sport you can see sport has been selected so guys now you can see right there now this is the pie token that i bought now you can see it 1.4076 pi token so the 2.33 years it gave me 1.4076 pi token so guys this is the pi token i just bought now so guys now i've been able now to show you guys how you can be able to buy pi token on gate.io is that easy it all depends on the amount of usdt that you have in your account if you have up to 100 usdt you can decide to use the 100 usdt to buy the pi token so if you have 1000 usdt you can decide to use it to buy the pi token so guys, um, this is how it can be done and I believe it was helpful. See you in the next upload. Bye.